Hello everybody, I am the Mighty Mango and welcome to Moko's Advice, a game where you give good or bad advice to strange beings. Let's play. Should I buy a new rug for my house? No. You were right. 356 is enough for now. What? <laughs> 356 rugs. My neighbor has hundreds of rugs in his house and I have none. Should I steal one? Yes. I should treat myself. I deserve a rug. I hardly have anything to eat anymore. Aww. Land is cheaper to the west. Should I buy some and build a farm there? No. Because if the... If it's cheaper, that probably means it's worse. Perhaps I should not. Dismiss the stories of flying murderous worms coming from the west. What? Flying murderous worms? Flying murderous worms? No! My neighbors stole some of my rugs. Should I kill them? What? Oh god, what if he started? I sh maybe I shouldn't have told them to steal the rugs. Oh no, um, uh, well, uh, um, uh, um, let's just go down this deep path. Yes, kill them. I will rescue my precious rugs and kill the thief. They will think twice next time about stealing from me. <laughs> oh god, that is beautiful. I think I'm sick. Should I go see a doctor? Well, you have two heads, so, um... But some people have had weird necks. That could just be what the norm is. Um, well, if you feel sick, you should probably see a doctor. Yes, yes. Now all I need to do is learn what a doctor is. Oh. Oh. Yesterday I saw a child. It was weird. I think it's following me. Is it following me? Yes, it is following you. It is as I feared. I must hurry. The child may abduct me and force me to become its parent. Oh no. Reverse adoption. The kid adopts you. My neighbor killed me. Was it because I stole some of his rugs? Wait, what? It, how are you... How are you here if you died? Um... No. I guess they were just giving me the knife as a gift. <laughs> as thanks for adopting some of their rugs. Yes! Yes, that's exactly why. He, he, he gifted you the knife directly into your stomach. Sometimes I worry I'll fall up into the sky. Is this likely to happen? Yes, of course. Do you not know the upwards of skyness? Where you fall up into the sky? Just randomly? I must find an anchor to attach my body before it's too late. Run, my child. And our little coin sack is stacking up. Is that- that is- that is straight up an onion. That is an onion. Don't even- don't even play. That is an onion. That is a grayed out onion. My doll is missing. Have you seen it? Yes. So it went this way. I wonder where it is going. Okay, I am writing a book. Should I give it a nice ending? No. A medical journal needs some pizzazz. At the end, I'll give them the wrong treatment method. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! I accidentally tore my pants. Should I stop wearing them? No. They are still completely functional pants. The giant hole in the front will be good ventilation. Uh, uh, I mean, I guess. Yeah, totally. Yeah, you, you do you. Just don't tell me. Don't tell them you heard it from me. If I travel back in time and kill my past self, will I be able to be to go back in time to kill my past self? Yes. Fantastic. If I kill my past self, then they will never waste a coin on asking you this question. Oh, it's the onion again. Yes. I love the onion. Should I avoid choosing against following through with deciding to not abstain from killing my loved ones? No. I will do as you say. Good onion. Kill your loved ones. Kill them. 
Oh, it's the onion again! Yay! Double onion! Adolescence keeps breaking into my store. Would traps deter them? Yes. Traps always deter people. I'm tired of them wrecking my business. I will rig my store to explode when it's broken into. <laughs> that is definitely most likely the most efficient way to get rid of them. Whoa, look at his neck. That is a... That is a neck. Damn. Should I give you a coin? Of course. Very well. Toss a coin to your moco. Oh, valley of strangelings. I'm secretly in love with a person I see every day. Do I tell them my feelings? Of course. I will do it. I will tell the person in the mirror how I truly feel about them. Good on you. Oh, onion. I snore in my sleep. He keeps waking me up. Can I fix it? Nope. Then I will never sleep again. There is no possible way that I could, this could backfire on me. Well, I'm pretty sure you're an onion, so probably not. You're probably all good, onion. Whenever I move, I hear footsteps. I think somebody is stalking me. Should I be worried? Nah, you'll be fine. I must be imagining it. Thank you for putting me at ease. You're welcome. Um. Oh no. It's so exhausting breathing all the time. Do I really have to keep doing it? Yes. Fine, I'll keep breathing, but I will not enjoy it. Well, you better not. I need a sacrifice. Do you think the person who was just here would make a good one? Yes! They have no friends. The shadows will be pleased. Well, I'm glad. Am I really here? No. Oh. Did they just fade out of existence? It's a cowboy! It is almost morning. Should I go to work today? No. I deserve a nice rest. Those kids can teach themselves for once. Welcome to 2020. Do you think your advice has hurt many people this night? Nope. If that helps you sleep. <laughs> it does. I helped a lot of people. Do you know the truth? Of course. Indeed. We must save the dream. Wah, wah, wah. Oh, look at all this money. Oh, what is it? What is that? You have me, Mizzy. Yes. Did we just... This should be enough. Did we just give him all of our... Money? What? And, well, that was the end, so I'm going to wrap the episode up here. But if you enjoyed the episode, please like, comment, and subscribe. It is always really appreciated. And I'll catch you guys next time. Bye-bye.